A well-designed and well-placed mirror can be a powerful asset to any room. In addition, it can be very versatile. It can make a space feel larger, it can emphasize colors or artwork, and even enliven rooms that do not have a window. Supplies needed for this project include Rust-Oleum paint, a round mirror from Dollar Tree, some faux jewels and pearls, hot glue, leaves of your choice, and small flowers, and a small scrap of ribbon, and a small piece of twine, and a round piece of wood. You want to glue the mirror to the wood round with some E6000. Then you want to take your leaves and flowers outside, make sure that you are masked up, and spray the flowers with the gold, bright gold Rust-Oleum paint. Once that is completed, you will bring them back into your home and uh, start to assemble them around the mirror. Want to make sure that you avoid the mirror until you have completed filling in all of the gaps with single leaves or maybe two or three leaves. I had to put the back of another mirror over the glued mirror to avoid distractions. Once you have glued all of the leaves around the mirror, now you can start with the flowers. You want to cut one flower off at a time, and then you want to disperse them here and there in between the leaves to your liking. I think it would give it a little bit more interest if you cut off three stems with flowers on it and place at least three of those around in the different areas of your mirror. You want to make sure that you cut the flowers low so that they don't stick up higher than the leaves. After you have arranged the flowers and the flowers on the stem, then you want to bring out your full diamond jewels and your pearls. And you can have a glam mirror, you can have a modern mirror, and the good thing about this, you can spray it any color that you like. So in order to place my hanger, cut a piece of jute, probably no more than an inch and a half, and then you want to cut a small piece of ribbon, make a loop, put lots of hot glue there, and then you can place the small piece of ribbon, pat it down, make sure that it is, has adhered well. It looks beautiful hanging on the wall, but it also will look good on a dresser. It can even look good on your dining room table with candles on it. So sometimes you make things and it just doesn't turn out like you would like it to. So everyone has a right to change up what they don't like. So I decided to do kind of a four seasons type of thing took off the leaves and I divided round a piece of wood up into four sections. I painted the one section black, I painted another section white, I painted another one camouflage, and then rust. I let them dry and then I just hot glued them back onto the wood round and it gives a whole different look, kind of a a modern look. That is my surprise. You have a right to change your mind and you might like the one that's all gold 
or you might like the one that is variegated. Let me know which one you like the best. Thank you. If you like what you have seen today, please like, comment, save, and subscribe. In addition, you can follow me on Instagram at Z9Designs. Thank you. Have a lovely day.